For the first time since early March, an official college basketball game found its way into Dahlberg Arena as the Montana Lady Grizz hosted the North Dakota Fighting Hawks in Monday's home opener. Normally the top draw in the Big Sky Conference for women's basketball, Dahlberg Arena certainly felt eerie without fans as Mike Petrino looked for his first win as the Lady Grizz head coach. Sophia Stiles was big in this one with a double-double, 21 points, 10 rebounds, including this drive to the basket. North Dakota kept it close early as Michaela Wallace ties at 16 all at the end of the first quarter. Hannah Thurman shows off the range with a three-pointer for Montana as the Lady Grizz take a 10-point lead at halftime. Second half now and Carmen G. Feller was tough to stop as she knocks down this triple. North Dakota rallied late to get within four points, but G. Feller was too much to handle scoring a career-high 27 points as the Lady Grizz win 86-72. to But in college basketball's new normal, adjusting to life without fans at home was still an odd first for UM. It's so weird playing without a crowd. Fans know that we have record-setting crowds every time, but... We still have a ton of support from people, whether that's through emails or texts or calls. We just really appreciate all of our fans out there still, still representing us and still cheering for us from behind their TV screens. I guess the positive is we have so many new players, they have no idea what the difference is. Okay, we have so many new players, they have no idea what they're missing. But for our returners and for us, it was surreal. If you're used to playing in front of a great crowd, when you don't have it, it's, it's different. I think a lot of it has just been, uh, my teammates really trust me. We've been practicing for five months straight now, and so I think we're finally getting the feel for each other, and I trust them to get me the ball. They know that I'm gonna go to work when I have it, and I trust them to keep moving and keep making plays, and so we're just getting the hang of things as it goes. I'm just proud of the kids. I'm proud of the kids. I'm proud out of uh, Jordan, Nate, and Jace, and JC, our trainer. JC's a good, huge MVP assist for him because he got <laughs> our players ready. You know, JC's dealing with COVID and he's dealing with our team and all the injuries we had. I'm just really proud and happy for them. That's, that's what it's all about. The next game for the Lady Grizz is scheduled to be on Sunday in Spokane against Gonzaga. In Missoula, Kyle Hansen, MTN Sports.